It's time for a pack opening here in NHL 23. I'm doing half of Hot Rush. Not all of Rush. No, this is week one. I'm going to do week two next week when there's more objectives. It, I, I spent almost four hours playing this game. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not sitting here for eight hours in one day and getting all of Rush done. So I'm going to take one week, get five million points. Took me about 40 games to get five million points. So we're going to open up all these packs here and see if we can get ourselves anything good. Now, what's nice is that, yeah, this is week one of the fantasy event. So next week, when I have all these other rewards, I can actually focus on week two of the fantasy event, have a chance at both weeks of this event. Kind of like it. I got 5 million points in about 40 games. It did take forever. It didn't take four hours. I've been here for about three. But even so, I just don't want to sit here all night grinding rush when I could just wait seven days and get objectives and just finish it way quicker. You know what I mean? So we're just going to go ahead and open up the packs. I've already gotten rid of all the collectible packs. So we have a mini pack, a one gold player pack, a two gold player pack, a three gold player pack, another mini, another two gold. We have a player pack, premium one gold, a premium four gold, a mini, a base, premium two gold, a premium pack, a four gold player pack, and a premium player pack. So we have a lot of good chances. We have some good stuff here. Hopefully we get lucky. I'm not, I'm not opening any more packs out of Hut Rush for seven days. So if we don't get anything now, we got to wait seven days out of Hut Rush, but that's all right with me. I really, I just can't be bothered to sit here for another four hours and, and, and just do this. I can't. Ty Smith, what's up, buddy? I'm hoping for a fantasy card. Considering you can't get them in like ultimate packs or anything like I'm going to get in uh, Rivals and Champs rewards. Like I'm going to have really good packs, but you can't pull the fantasy cards in them because they're not 80 overall as we do get a Breeze Ball. There you are, man. Nice to see an icon. We can use that later to trade in for uh, uh, power up icons. So as many of those as I can get, the better. We get 79, 78, and 76. Wonderful. Now, I like what EA is doing with Hut Rush. Don't get me wrong. They're giving you a reason to play it. And like, it's very easy to complete if you don't want to do it all in one sitting, right? That's the thing with this Hut Rush. Uh, you have four weeks, four different sets of objectives that are going to give you millions of points. So you don't need to worry about it. But like for someone like me who wants to do it all at once, I, I, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. It's not. <laughs> it's not worth it. So I'll finish them next week and we'll have part two and hopefully get ourselves something crazy in the part two. And hopefully in part one as well. Let's be real. Something crazy in both uh, both weeks would be awesome. But this way, not only do I get to spread it. Like last year, I would have gotten two hot rush videos to you guys. So I'm, we got an icon. Oh my. Oh my, could this be the Gretzky or Lemieux I've been waiting for? I have opened up a dozen of those power-up icon packs and haven't pulled anything above an 86. And now we get 40 how? Oh my God, let's go. Holy crap. I'm not, that's insane. That's my best icon pull of the year. That's, that's awesome. Hut Rush pays off. Let's go. This is actually amazing. Not only is this one of the best icons you can get, but it's also one of the best players of all time. And he's on my favorite team. This is going to help me for my uh, my team the entire year. I'm a huge Red Wing fan, obviously. And uh, I, I, by the end of the year, I like to have an all Red Wing squad. And to get a pull like this out of Hut Rush, that is absolutely amazing. Out of curiosity, I'm going to go on the market and see. I, I can't sell him. He's, un he's untradeable. But I want to know how much he's worth. Really, I, I think that's uh, a card that you can trade in for Gretzky and Lemieux as well. You need him, Messier, and someone else, I think. So, let's see. Is there any Gordie Howes on the market to find out what his price is here? Obviously, they're all the Alumni Association. Go down to Detroit. And there is none up. So, no idea what his value is, but bang! An 87 Gordie Howe! Nothing's going to top that. Nothing is going to top that, but you cannot complain getting something like that out of Hut Rush. Week one was a success. Will week two be as much of a success is the real question. Premium four gold player pack. This could have something in it. It could, absolutely. Bang, no, nothing. Eklund, Moran, Tanev, Tim Stutzla. We got an 81 out of there. I'm still like reeling over the fact that I just got a Gordy Howe. That is amazing. Now. Yeah, it's not Gretzky or Lemieux. I'm sure someone's going to be like, <laughs> I got Lemieux and you got stuck with how, you idiot. I'm sure somebody in the comments is going to say it. But do you know what? I am happy. Gordy freaking how. 
You have a few more packs here, a premium two gold, a premium, a four gold player, and a premium player pack. Let's see if we get lucky. All we need is one of these to hit. That's all we need. I mean, we've already had one hit, but you know what I mean. If you want one more big pull, this is we still have that opportunity. It still can come. And then next week, we're going to do this again with better packs and see if we can uh, do better. And we can compare what's better, the first half or the second half of Hut Rush. I'm just going to skip the rest here. We do get Thomas Tatar, former Red Wing there. I will say, I really like the look of these jerseys. I don't know what it is, but there's something about them I really like. All right, four goal player pack. Come on, let's go. Hook me up. We get Taylor Radish. That's not really what I'm looking for. Not a single fantasy card. I, I will say um, I've opened a lot of packs this event, and I've not pulled a single fantasy item. I would like to get one at some point. Maybe tomorrow, or I guess today when you're seeing this, when I get Rivals and Champs rewards if I'm lucky, but like... Why are they so hard to pull? Just give me one. Jonathan Bernier, what's up? Anything else in the pack? We're not going to end it off on an 81, are we? We get an 80. Colin Miller. All right, you know what? We'll do uh, We'll do a couple packs here just to try and uh, end it off on a high note. Can't believe I got Gordy Howe. I can't open any of these packs. I can do an elite pack. Maybe we get something in an elite pack. Maybe. I'd be down for it. Give me like a Christian Dvorak. Primetime? Not really what I'm... Oh my! Sidney Crosby! <laughs> All right, the pack luck it might be back. Holy crap. Sidney Crosby in a 25k elite pack. That is how you end off a pack opening. I'm very happy with today. I cannot complain whatsoever. Crosby and how welcome aboard. For sure, Gordy Howe is going to slot in. Like, it'll probably be Solani that goes, right? Solani's gonna go, and then he's bringing Gordy Howe, and then... Yeah, I mean... What, what's Howe's face-offs? Where is Howe? Did they make him a, a, a winger? Am I insane? Is he just a winger? He is a winger, okay. His face-offs are 74, so he won't be a center for me, but this is a card that's gonna be on the team for sure. He will play. That is uh, absolutely awesome for me to get. Gordy freaking Howe. I mean, synergy-wise, he doesn't get a speed boost or anything, but cl like close quarters... Unstoppable Force, like he has the best synergies in the game too. This is going to be a fun cart. All right, guys, well, that's going to do it for this video. Week one of Hut Rush for the second season of the year. However, week two, seven days, we have a base pack. We have a premium three gold player, another premium pack, a jumbo premium pack, a prime pack, a base pack, an NHL player pack, another prime pack, a player's pack, a premium four gold, a jumbo premium pack, a prime pack, a player's pack, and a mega player's pack. So week one, we got Gordy Howe. Week two, who knows what we're going to get. We'll find out in one week when I finish up Hot Rush. I kind of like this, having the uh, the separate weeks here. Not grinding it all out in one night. I can do one week, and then another week, get two videos to you guys, and we can compare. But so far, Gordy Howe is the best pull I think I've ever had in Hot Rush. Anyways, guys, I'm out of here. Thanks for watching. Have a wonderful night. I'll see you guys over on Twitch. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay frosty.